but I saw these fruits at the store. It's a bunch of fruits that I haven't uh, tried before, and I'm really excited, but I wanted to do it again. So we got apricots, a grapefruit, an avocado, which I don't know if that consider is considered a fruit. I think that's up for debate whether it's a fruit or a vegetable. And then we got the thing that I'm really, really excited for. I know this looks like an alien egg. It's not, I promise. It's a dragon fruit. I'm so excited to see it, like, in person. I've never had this before. I've never seen it before, like, not in person. I've always seen it in videos but I never see them like at the market where I live and I saw it and I had to grab it because I wanted to try this for forever. So that's why I wanted to do another funky fruit episode. So let's try the apricots. Now this is pretty easy. Uh, it just says sun-dried apricots. Uh, I guess I assume they're dried. So they're just little... They smell funky. Yeah, they're dry. Okay, they look wetter in the bag, but they're not. Yeah, it smells not great, to be honest. It kind of smells like, this is going to be a weird thing, but it's like, you ever like eat a peach and then like, like take a bite out of a peach and then like leave it and let the air get to it? Like it kind of smells like. If you let an, like a peach like go bad or something like it doesn't. All right. Hard. But then again, they're dry too. It's okay. I think it'd be better with a little bit of juice, like. See, apricot's one of those things where I feel like I've had it with stuff. You know, like in those, like... You know those, like, fruit cups for children? I feel like there's apricots in that. Or, you know, trail mix sometimes has, like, little dried apricots or stuff like that. This isn't... Like, dried apricot, I don't know if that's a thing to have by itself. Like, I don't know if you would just snack away at this by itself, you know. I mean, I'm not saying they're good, but I think it needs something. Like, either, like other fruits like your or fruit juices you know it's just a little like probably regular not dried these are probably very good they're just a little you know plain dried so i mean um but that's you know technically my fault because i picked them up dried they didn't have any uh fresh one so i'll just give it a th sideways thumb that's a margin of error on my part that's not the apricots fault they're just better probably fresh with the juice in it all right so next we got a grapefruit this is a red grapefruit i know it's yellow but it said on the label it said red mm, grapefruit it's pink or should be pink or i assume it's gonna be yeah pink or reddish on the inside so cut it in half cut it in half or you think i should cut like a slice in it like the how i did the asian pear it doesn't matter all right i'll see about cutting the slice in it i'm being very careful because my mom has instructed me to not cut myself. So I'm trying not to, people. You can smell it. I did it! Yay! Mm. See? Mm. I'm capable! It just smells like oranges. It's kind of like orangey. Pink on the inside. I don't know if red is the right word. It's definitely like a fleshy tone. Let me take out that seed. All right. You're, this is going to be sour, people. We always say about grapefruit being a sour fruit. I've never had it by itself. I know a lot of people have them like with a spoon for breakfast. I'm just eating it straight up, so <sighs> not a smart idea, but here we go. It's actually not sour at all. It just tastes like an orange. Oh, okay. It's got a little bit of a sour aftertaste. It's not bad, though. It's a bit of a weird... Like, you know when you drink lemonade and you have that kind of, like, scratchiness? 
And you're, you know, because the citric acid is like, I don't know, irritating? Your, like, it's like breaking away your throat, you know, because they say like meat, you know, citrus, it like breaks down meat. So when you, you know what I mean? It kind of just gives that little bit of <clears throat> scratchiness in your throat, but it's not bad. It's fine. I'd probably, uh, maybe eat it again, like, again in either a fruit salad or I might have it like a snack or what it's not bad it's not as sour as I've heard that grapefruits are unless this is a certain maybe it's a blend of an orange and a grapefruit you know maybe it's not complete grapefruit but it's not it's not bad it's fine I'll give it a thumbs up it's okay all right so now we've got the the one up for debate I don't know if this is technically a fruit or a vegetable so yeah now this I gotta cut very carefully because this is a pit on in the middle so uh, maybe you could do like you did with that one with the a slice yeah I can try okay, hold on. yep there we go okay hard to because because the skin is so like similar Maybe we should have peeled it first probably but we don't you know we, we don't just eat avocados huh i don't eat avocados i obviously i said i've never had them before so how are we supposed to know if we're doing it right you know people people who eat avocado please let me know i think you're supposed to peel it but Probably. I don't know if you're supposed to eat the skin. So, mm. I'm just going off of... I wouldn't, just in case. Huh? I yeah, wouldn't. I'm not gonna. I'm just trying to... Yeah. Because I didn't... Okay, there we go. I'm gonna cut, like... I'm gonna peel the skin with the knife and then take a little chunk out of it. Look at the the spoon okay i know this is not how you're supposed to eat it but again i've never eaten avocado before and it looks very difficult to cut and i'm afraid to cut too far because i don't want to hit the pit and then cut myself by trying to get the skin on so i'm just doing it like this okay please don't hate me in the comments yeah i hear avocado is good like good for you and stuff like that you know so, I have high expectations. Okay. Trying to get a little bit of the, the so-called meat of the avocado. See, it looked, because it's green, I want to I want to put in the vegetable group, but it smells good. It smells good. It also kind of smells like grass, which, you know, but it smells like good grass. Does that make sense? Not that type of grass. Like, you know, like good fresh cut grass, but then not in a bad way. It smells fresh, you know, clean. All right, here we go. Again, eating this wrong, but. I know avocado is like good for your skin. Not if you eat it, I mean if you put it on your face. I know they make guacamole out of this. It's very bland. But then again, I'm not doing anything to it. I know some people have it with like salt and some people put in their eggs and stuff like that. Yeah, it's just... <clears throat> I can take a drink because it's a bit... Ugh. I don't love it, to be honest. At least not by itself. Again, maybe if I did it with stuff. You know, if I cut it correctly, if I peeled it correctly. You know, if I had it co cooked by a professional, probably with, again, either salt or other stuff with it, I probably would maybe like it. But as, like, raw by itself, I don't. So, I'll give it a middle waist thumb. It's another, like, 
It's bad, but not because of the fruit itself. It's bad because I didn't prepare. That's not the fruit, vegetable, whatever you want. Thing of a bob, you want to call this thing. It's not its fault. You know, it's mine for not preparing it better. It, I should have peeled it before we were started recording. I should have thought to put stuff with it or looked up what to do with avocados. But yeah, I'll just give it a side with them. If somebody knows how to prepare avocado, like what goes good with avocados, you know, tell me. And then, you know, I'll see what I could do. All right. <clears throat> so, here is the one that I'm really excited for. We've got my, my baby, the dragon fruit. Now, I assume these grow on trees. I was talking to my mom about this, but I just love how it looks. You know, I just love the... You, no other fruit looks like this. The only other thing is maybe a pineapple, but I just love the color of it, the spikes on it, and it doesn't feel like how you'd think it feels. You'd think it feels sharp. It actually feels pretty, like, soft and smooth. Like, I just love everything about this fruit, just aesthetic-wise. But... Be prepared for something surprising, because let me get this stuff out of the way. You're going to want to zoom up on this, Mom, because the inside I know. Well. does not look how you think it would. Look at that! Ain't that insane? I love how that looks, though. Like, it looks like an alien egg on the outside, but damn, it just is such a beautiful fruit, man. Like, smell like, even if I absolutely hate this, I could still love it aesthetic-wise. It's such a beautiful fruit. Oh. What? It doesn't smell good, unfortunately. This one smells like grass. I said that one smells like grass. I kind of like this one really smells like grass. I hope it's not another... Oh, it's not ripe. See, I wish that... It looks fine, but... Yeah. But I just love how it looks, man. It's beautiful. All right. Now, yes, you can't... the smaller one. Huh? I want you eat the smaller piece. Oh. That works, too. Yeah, it smells like weeds. But I just love how it looks, man. I just love everything about it, like, aesthetic-wise. Oh, that sound. Did you hear that? Mm. Ugh. Yes, you can't eat the seeds, but I just, I love how it looks, man. Like the black and the white, and just, oh, it's beautiful. All right, drum roll. Without the... <laughs> Ooh, it actually don't taste the seeds very much, which is weird. There's actually not much taste. Like, it kind of tastes like a mixture of things. Like, it kind of tastes like... It kind of tastes like a kiwi and a watermelon had a baby. Because the seeds really make it taste like a kiwi. Because, you know, you could eat the seeds of a kiwi, too. But the, like, the juiciness, like, the way it, like, breaks apart, I guess, so easily in your mouth really reminds me of watermelon in a way. Like, the way it just breaks down so easily. It's really good. Like, it doesn't really have a taste. But it's still very, like, I don't know if how, it's, it's weird. It's still very good, though. Even though it doesn't have really a taste, it just, it's still, like, kind of, like, a weird texture experience. But, yeah, it's definitely somehow, like, a kiwi and a watermelon kind of, you know, got together. But it's still very good. I could definitely see this in, like, a, uh. I don't know how you would cut it up in a fruit salad, but, you know, it'd be good in a fruit salad. Or some people make, like, uh, alcoholic drinks out of this, like, you know, in, you know, uh, other parts of the world. So I could definitely see them doing stuff with it, you know, putting other stuff with it. Um, putting it in juices, because it does have um, healing properties, excuse me. Um, it's really good. I'll definitely give it a thumbs up and just... You know, obviously, look, it, it wins my favor, but it's still, it's just a good fruit in general. It still tastes pretty good. I really, w I wish I saw it more often around, but, uh, but, 
you know, that's, I guess, it's hard to grow them here. I guess it's hard to ship, get them shipped. Um, if I had to rate my favorite, I definitely think, yes, it is the dragon fruit. Because, you know, it's just the most normal. It's just the norm. It's the thing I could see the, myself eating the most, like, out of the four. Least favorite? Um, I think the avocado, just because it's so bland at least by itself again maybe cooked up in something or with something it's probably a lot better i'm probably eating it wrong and i admit that i'm eating eating it wrong and i don't blame you if you roast me down in the comments that i don't know what i'm doing with avocado that's the whole point of the show people i don't know what i'm doing i'm getting exposed to the world you know of not knowing these things you know i was a picky kid and so to I'm trying these things that everyday people try, you know, for the first time. So, of course, I don't know what I'm doing, but it'd be better for you to let me know versus, you know, getting angry at me. But, yeah, probably, you know, if somebody told me how to make it better, like, with stuff, I'd probably be better. But just as is, it's not. It's just kind of bland. It's just kind of blah. It's just not there. But... Uh, that wraps up this video. If you have any suggestions of what you want to see me try or what you want to see me talk about, write it down in the comments, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!